Matsumoto and beans? Since the 1950s, Matsumoto Shave Ice has been a staple in the North Shore of Oahu for its favorite local treats and its friendly atmosphere. More and more people from all over the world. It's really fun to meet all these different customers from all over the world. We're from Sacramento, California. Sydney, Australia. Ever Beach. Wailua. Japan. Hawaii Kai. Food plays a big role in bringing people from across the globe to the historic town of Haleiwa. And with this comes a lot of development to the area. For small businesses such as Matsumoto Shave Ice, it is unknown exactly how different this area will become. I don't know how it's going to be until the development comes around for our site next year. The Kamehameha School started their construction project in early 2013, planning to maintain the character of the North Shore. But some are fearful that by renovating and expanding, the older local businesses will actually lose the old town's character. I think that one of the things that people like about this North Shore is that they can come up here and it's got a really nice laid back feel to it. And I think if you start putting up large buildings, it's going to ruin the atmosphere. We're going to learn like what Hawaii was and we should keep it like how it was before. There's a lot of new construction. I've been here ever since I was little. So it's going to be really different watching everything just change. Hopefully they'll make good choices when they develop and not just think of the money, but you know, keeping the, the feel of Haleiwa the same. I was uh, surprised that the people out here didn't stop this development. I'm kind of like a little edgy right now. I can't do anything about it, but this is you know, not my property. But it is where the shop has been for the past 60 years. And even though the full effects of reconstruction are still unknown, Matsumoto's will do whatever they can to make sure they can still serve up their sweet shave ice. We're thinking of maybe moving out of here. I kind of grew up from day one over here, so it was so hard to try to move out from this area. I always think of the local people first, because they're the ones that made Matsumoto what it is today. The reconstruction isn't just affecting Matsumoto's, but also the rest of the businesses in Haleiwa. On one hand, change and modernization is inevitable, but a lot of times I, I don't agree with the type of change. That's why they always have the slogan, keep the country country, and I'm kind of nervous about, I don't know how it's going to happen. But for now, Matsumoto Shave Ice can only hope that their goal of keeping the spirit of local businesses alive will continue even though their future is still unknown. Erin Yuasa, Now Loading News.